everyone welcome back thanksgiving is upon us the holidays are literally next week and it hasn't really hit me yet that it's about to be thanksgiving it's nice that work is slowing down and i'm really excited for that two-day break just because i'm so checked out with work right now but before i can think about thanksgiving we have a busy weekend ahead and i'm really excited to bring you all along to all the shenanigans that i'll be enduring this weekend russ and i are going to go to our last concert for this year i think it's going to be a grand total of nine or ten for 2024 so we'll see if we go to that many concerts next year but it's going to be the iso knock 2 concert at bill graham i'm really excited to see knock 2 again especially after we saw his set at outside lands and then a few of my college friends will be here for the weekend so we're going to have a hangout day on saturday we'll see if we make it out to downtown that day it is going to rain so I'm not too sure, but we have a lot of other small things planned. So it's gonna be a little bit busy before the holidays. Yeah, I'm really excited to just relax once Thanksgiving comes. It's been really nice just kind of laying low ever since our New York trip. I like intentionally wanted to not be too stocked up on my events for the rest of the fall and winter. I feel like in the last few years, I always stack all my events every single weekend. I was like always booked, always going somewhere. So I think I'm finally entering the slow life era of my 20s and I'm really enjoying it. And I've also really been enjoying vlogging. I feel like this is the most consistent I've ever vlogged and posted videos outside of traveling. I've talked about this before, but ever since my first Korea trip back in 2022, I feel like I was so hyper fixated on only posting travel content and travel vlogs, but honestly, that's just not sustainable for me just because I just can't be traveling like that. But it's been really nice just consistently vlogging these past few weeks. I feel like this last month of just filming without a real set intention has helped me kind of just reconnect with my love for content creation and I feel a lot more fulfilled with YouTube these days. I think the numbers are still pretty stagnant and I'm trying not to focus on the numbers and just focus on how I feel when I post these videos. And honestly, all of your comments, I read every single one, it makes posting any video just so much worth it. So yeah, that's how I've been feeling the last few weeks or so. It's been really good, even though work has been driving me crazy and there's just so much shit going on with work. I think outside of work, I'm in a really good place. I feel like my daily routine has been consistent, my workout routine. I've also been healing my relationship with food, which has been so fulfilling for me. But enough chit chat. It is the end of the day, I need to just check up on work real quick before I leave because I'm gonna go get dinner with Brie and Nikki. They actually used to be my coworkers, but three of us haven't had dinner in such a long time. So yeah, I'm really excited to see them. Let's go.
you know. You said go fish playing Uno. Oh, Make these moves in the bush. I don't get stuck. Always on the rush. Hidden gem, I'm the old man in the brush. Running out barrel. Hit the stairs. Getting out of bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Life in that tough. Way too stable. No need for the crush. Dropping them hits like Blitz. I bought my cheese like Ritz. Fuck a vacay, don't trip. Y'all don't know people like this. 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 Dropping them hits like Blitz. I bought my cheese like Ritz. Fuck a vacay, don't trip. Thank <laughs> you. 